Go grab a ruler. I want to measure. I, I don't want to. Can you go grab a ruler? Oh my god. What? It's tiny. <laughs> Hey, dog, stop yapping and show us your meat. You want me to crash out? All right, ladies and gentlemen, it's your favorite Mexican Renko here. Hope you're all doing well today. I'm not doing too bad myself. Today, we're looking at a Darman clone that's so bad, it's funny. It's called Tomorrow's Teachings. And the video from them that we're watching today is, brace yourself, white kid gets shamed for his small wiener. You won't believe it. This should be amazing content. This should be incredibly valuable content that teaches us many lessons. Best believe they got the quality up too. We're watching this bitch in 4K resolution. Anyways, join the new Discord server because my last one got rated at 50,000 members and I'm trying to rebuild this one, so join. Coming up on tomorrow's teachings. Let's go. Stop yapping and show us your meat or I'm gonna crash out. What? I'm gonna crash out for not seeing some, wait. Yo, who is this, bro? This guy looks mad familiar. Where have I seen this? Bro, if y'all know who this is, comment down below. I don't know where. I, maybe TikTok, YouTube. Anyways, he's going to crash out over not seeing some meat. I'm already confused on so many levels. Two inches. I said drop your pants. I want to see how small it is. <laughs> Freaky ass intro. Tomorrow's teachings might have Darman beat with the intro game. I won't lie. Oh my God. Is that I show speed? This wiener's huge. I'm like a big look. It's giant. Bro, is this man just gonna sit there? He's just sitting here taking it, taking this cuck treatment from this girlfriend. She's fantasizing about the I show meat clip. That is a red flag. Bro needs to dip from that relationship. On cap. No god. How big do you think that is? I don't know. Is this man scared? It's probably fake. No. That's real. Oh my god. Can we can we go outside? How big do you think that is? How big is yours? Oh no, nah, bro, she's about to compare meats. Bro needs to break this off before she breaks him. Go grab a ruler. I want to measure. The foot I, I don't want to. Can you go grab a ruler? He might be cooked. The moment of truth. Drop him. Damn. Bro's mind is running with the paranoia. I can only imagine how he's feeling right now. He probably thinks his world is ending. Oh, God. <laughs> I like how they added the little dark lines on the side of the vignette to make it more dramatic. Bro, why is tomorrow's teachings Loki a little funny? Oh my God. What? It's tiny. Ah! Oh. Hey chat, comment down below if your girlfriend has ever told you that your wiener's tiny. If that genuinely happens to any one of y'all, then I actually feel bad, man. I, I hope that you've learned to cope through that situation. And, you know, life isn't all about dick sizes, you know? Some would even say the motion of the ocean is what matters a lot more. And, you know, you're going to be fine. But again, I'm sorry that happened to you. That must suck. Anyways, I'm going to be looking at the comments after this video drops. What? It's like... It's like two inches. What? That's normal. Yeah, maybe for Discord users, bucko, but not in real life. Are all white guys wieners this small or is it just you? Oof! You know what? I'm leaving. Like, I can't even do anything with that. Oh my god. That's like taking a tomahawk straight to the chest. Not the shower after, bro. Come on. This channel is too funny. Bro is deep in his feelings right now. He's going through song lyrics, reminiscing on the time he had his girl before she shamed his small willy. Pain. Nah, but chat, actually comment down below if this has happened to you. I know there's gotta be at least one. Bro, what? Hold on, run that back. This dude was putting himself on roller skates with his own dribbling. Bro, waddling around like a duck. Copyrighted music. Hey, hey, copyrighted music. You know I gotta mute that copyrighted music. Hey, hey, copyrighted music. Yeah, yeah, copyrighted music. Hey, hey, copy. Chat, is this Rez? Me? Bro's about to say never dribble a basketball again. What's your name, boy? Jacob? Jacob. 
Are you here for the right sport? Called it. He's about to start flaming his basketball abilities. Let's hear it. You do know in basketball, the ball is supposed to go in the basket. Cheerleading tryouts are just outside. <laughs> That's crazy. Oh my God. I remember I used to play basketball back in like in sixth grade. If somebody would have told me that I should have been a cheerleader, I would have started crying right then and there. I'm just a bit rusty. I didn't have enough time to practice over summer. Nah, bro. We're not going to forget about this, okay? You're more than rusty. Go to a training camp or something. Excuses. Get back out on the court and give me 10 suicides. Yes, coach. Bro shoots himself. Hey, Jacob. What's up, Max? How do you think you did? Terrible, bro. Should have practiced way more through summer. Same. It's okay, though. We'll still make the team. We just won't be starters. Yeah. We bench warmers. Girls have fun out there? <laughs> oh, shit. Man, when I was draining these threes, these niggas were painting their toes. Shut up, Dominic. I know that ain't come out of your mouth. <laughs> shit, if you trying to throw down, we could throw down, Casper. Nah, that ain't fair. Come on. Look at the kid. He's white. He got no hands whatsoever. No way he can't fight it. Shit, he can't even make a layup out there. You see the way he jumped? Damn, bro's whole entire life is a humiliation ritual. First, it was this girl exposing his meat. Second, it's this dude just clowning him. I know dude's about to crash out. Boy was like, <laughs> like, what was that? <laughs> you know what they say, white man can't jump. <laughs> yeah, we can. <laughs> hey, Jacob, I'll catch you later. Goofy white boy. We should cut him some slap. <laughs> I already clapped his girl. Oh, hell no. This dude is insanely close to crashing out. You already know it. A fly could fly in front of his face and that would cause him to crash out right now. What? Oh, it's like, never mind. He's just a little sensitive. Man, she didn't tell you? That's tough, man. Bro, I was hitting it from every position in the book. I had her hypnotized. Nah, but like genuine question, what would you do if you were in this situation and you're the white boy? Do you either A, crash out, two, uh, start throwing a hissy fit in a fetal position on the floor, C, turn racist, D, contact the school authorities? What would you do? Cause you already know Buddy's going through an immense amount of pain, bro. I feel for this character. I had her squirming and oh everything. Oh my God. She was screaming my name, miles, miles, miles. He's just taunting him now. I wouldn't be surprised if he started emoting, bro. Is he gonna fight him or something? <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> Damn! Do the shit again, boy. I dare you. Yeah, he's fucked. Allie loved me. She took this D like a champ. Oh, God. She was sick and tired of your little shrimp. Yeah, bro. You um, know what they say. Once you go black, you never go back. Yeah, dude's getting the full humiliation ritual treatment right now. This is hard to watch. But I'm hoping the white kid has a comeback arc. That'd be pretty cool to witness. Yo, he really got a small wiener? Of course he does. He's white. All white guys got small meats. Chat, this is propaganda. I'm kind of curious. Let me see how small it is. Hey, yo, this shit about to turn gay. Drop your pants. What? No. I said drop your pants. I want to see how small it is. Well, leave me alone. Is this what happens when college kids get hazed? I've heard like really bad stories with that stuff. Someone help me. Help. Hey, dog, stop yapping and show us your meat or I'm going to crash out. Zestiest crash out in history. Okay, fine. Okay, fine. I'll show you the meat. Oh no. The third humiliation. <laughs> That's the smallest wiener I've ever seen, bro. <laughs> Yo, it looks like a peanut. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh my god, bro. I would kill myself if I were. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. What? Tomorrow's teachings, bro. I gotta ask about this script. Let's talk about that. What lessons are you teaching from this, bro? This has got to be completely satire. Like, god damn. You ain't getting no girls with that tap pool. <laughs> okay, bro. Come on. Shitty acting. Upon Jacob's return home, he quickly discovered that Coach Miles had shared the photos of Jacob's small vena Bruh. throughout the school, Bruh. leaving Jacob devastated. Mm. Now everyone is aware of his small meat. Bruh. Meanwhile, Jacob receives another blow when his mom calls him with devastating news. Oh my his God. His sister 
has been kidnapped. Oh by my god. Assassin. The plot just keeps on getting crazier and crazier, bro. And we're never going to catch a moment where it just dies down and it's some simple dialogue. No, it's always something happening with this. Poor Jacob, dog. We're all praying for you right now. Hey, everybody, I want to see some prayer emojis for Jacob. The news is heart-wrenching. And they fear the worst. That she may be dead. Dear mom and dad, I'm writing this because I can't bear the weight of my shame and sadness any longer. Damn, bro, I was right. He's actually, oh my God. Come on, man, you don't have to do this. I want you to know that this decision has nothing to do with you. No. You've always been there for me. No. I've been drowning in a sea of humiliation and despair. Hey, bro's kind of a poet. I'm nothing more than a joke. No. My self-esteem is shattered. For real. Please don't blame yourselves for what I'm about to do. No, Jacob, this stop. This is my choice. My way of ending the pain. Holy shit, has bro. Me for Holy, far shit. Too Holy shit. Holy shit, Jacob, stop. Hey, I love dude, you don't words don't do that. Don't do that. Hey, get back. Goodbye. Get back. Get back, guy. Jacob? Oh shit. Out of all people that could have stopped his suicide, it was the one who made him want to commit suicide. If I was Jacob right now, I'd just jump off right after I see him. Are you here to beat me up or something? Cuz you don't need to. I'm killing myself! Jacob, get down from there. Leave me alone. Get off me! What are you doing? What does it look like? You made my life hell. I'm ending it. No, you can't do that. Hey, apologize then, Jacob, fool. I'm sorry. There we go. I didn't know I affected you this much. There we go. You made fun of me for having a small wiener. And then you guys showed the whole school. Yeah, that is fun, bro. <sighs> I don't know what I was thinking. This is all my fault. I should be the one jumping off of a bridge. Of course not. Yeah, I made fun of you for something you can't control. Oh, we actually get a lesson out of this? No way, bro. Let's go the morale of the story. Don't make fun of people for aspects of their life that they can't control. W. That's horrible, man. I'm sorry. Look, can I be honest with you? Yeah. Me and Allie only went on a date one time and we didn't even do anything hey not gonna lie though this is actually the type of stuff that guys will lie about in college i used to have this one friend that would non-stop cap out of his ass about girls he slept with and he built up like a horrible reputation in town because he was just lying about everybody since then i cut his dumb ass off you know i only said all that to be cool and reality is i have a small wiener too wow you and me both ass moment really yeah, I'm insecure, and I lash out on students like you. I didn't know the damage I could do. I thought you were going to kill yourself. Well, I was. But now he's not. Tomorrow's teachings, you've made my night. Small wiener gang. Hey, don't leave me out. Oh, Ma? no. Jacob? The speed glazer? What are you guys doing here? Get her out of here. None of your business. Why don't you just... Get lost. Yeah. Sorry, what did you say to me, Shrimp? Oh, no. You gonna do anything about this? He's about to jump. Oh! <laughs> Bruh. Well, I guess we won't be seeing her again. This is the craziest plot of all time. Hey, yo. Hey, yo, hey, yo, bro, <laughs> with Indian music is crazy. Anyways, uh, yeah, that was just about as bad as I thought, but it's so bad, it's good. You know what I'm saying, chat? There can be things out there that are just so damn bad that they're entertaining because of the fact that they're that bad. But bro, I need sleep and you need sleep. Let's f***ing sleep. I'll catch y'all. By the way, join the Discord. And also feel free to watch another video since you already watched this one. Peace.